Dominguez was wildly impressive in spring training. He had a .455 batting average, 4 home runs and a 1.566 OPS in 11 games. Yankee fans subscribe to the channel to receive all the latest Yankees news. As a reminder, he's just 20 years old. He's starting in AA because he was a late-season call-up for the Patriots last season. Anecdotally, it felt like some of the hype surrounding Dominguez had started to fade, but it's back. It wouldn't be stunning if he somehow found a way to be a September call-up this season, but he likely will have to show he's incredibly advanced for that to happen. And after Dominguez's impressive first big-league spring training, Yankees decision-makers couldn't be more excited to see how he follows it up. It's been almost four years since they gave him a franchise record $5.1 million signing bonus out of the Dominican Republic, captivated by his otherworldly blend of speed, power and switch-hitting ability at age 16. But Dominguez really started impressing the Yankees well before this spring, well before his .455 batting average, four home runs and 1.566 OPS in 11 games in his first big league camp had fans on social media begging for him to start in left field in the Bronx. Peraza will get the most attention in Scranton. He was projected as the Yankees' opening day shortstop entering spring training but then struggled at the plate while number one prospect Anthony Volpe emerged as the best option. Peraza doesn't have much to prove in AAA, he already showed last season that he's capable of hitting at that level. But because of the Yankees' logjam of infielders, there's no space for him in the Bronx. Yankees manager Aaron Boone said Peraza likely won't play third base, even though the future at the position is open once Josh Donaldson is off the books. Yankee fans subscribe to the channel to receive all the latest Yankees news.